to their home of Philadelphia, which is about an hour and a half away from Bethlehem. And then they got starting here, PBC on FS1. Great to be with all of you. And I mean, you know, he's fighting here in the featherweight division in this matchup, but he typically is 122. Especially you've been on a diet for a long period of time. You know, it makes it tough. You got a rebound right. But Radaz, this is the most experienced guy that Fulton has been in the ring with. Jab. And Fulton is a father of. That'd be nice. Come home as the winner. Celebrate a nice birthday. Well, for Fulton. 122 pound fighters. You're fighting on the same card. Yeah, it looks like he's getting a little fired up. Hey, certainly, you know, the tippers are. Steve Fulton, just 24 years of age, comes to his ring attire and also his performance inside the ring. You can see that experience in him, you know, moving away from the jab. 2016, a eighth round TKO loss at the hands of Daniel Franco. The lighter weight classes. Yeah, it's a good resume. Good experience for him, especially. But if Fulton is to really go out, absolutely. Well, they're both only separated by three years. Fulton's 24. Stephen Fulton from Philadelphia jabbing. I'd like to see Fulton mix that jab up a little bit. He gets his body's in gear. He's only 32 years of age, and he has over 100 fights. 100. Like Fulton. Big right hand by Fulton. Simple fundamentals that we're seeing being used by Stephen Fulton. It switches up their style. You know, it's not their strength, so you want to get on them. A little more, more pressure. It's significant. He's pounding his head. <laughs> but that no part of him. He is next against Nick Jones. He's on shies away from everything. You know, jab comes, you slip back, move. It's like he's always. It almost seems like Mirage just goes into that. Let him go. Let him go. Sweat that off. Sweat that off. In the least amount of danger seen in the early going, if you can outclass a guy, if you can do some things, he's going to step his game up and get out there and make it happen. 72nd mark. Stop. In round four. Stop. Stop. My break. My break. Step back. Doing pretty much what he wants against Herman Meraz. He's doing his job. <laughs> when Fulton is pressing the issue, it's almost uh, we'll talk about it a little bit later. But oh yeah, definitely. Especially you got a young child. You can always use the paycheck. Did by Stephen Fulton. Area. Nice right hand that crushed right into Meraz. The point of attack for Stephen Fulton. Yeah, Meraz does just. Well, Fulton, he hasn't fought here in California in, since 2014, so nice for him to come. So, I believe so, you're right. Getting ready for the fight with Donaire, so. Yeah, that jab is allowing him to dictate this fight. Round six scheduled for eight. And Meraz again is just, he isn't doing anything significant. Fulton is just so. Yeah, Fulton's doing a great job doing that. You know, especially with the uh, customer. He's getting some good work out of it. He's on national TV. And, uh, you know, he's just. Midway point around six. <laughs> Knowing that man. He thought the fight was canceled and gets this opportunity out here. Then your fight gets canceled. All that training you put in in time and then. Having no issues with whatsoever. Well, Fulton is in total control here. A little bit. Throw some body shots, pick and poke with it, and, you know, fire that right hand. Yeah, anytime he lets his hands go, you know, he does a great job. He lands big shots. Meraz is, as we see, his face is red in. Well, um, where it's like, you see the shot, but then it, he moved. Oh. 
David, a full 10 campaign in the Bantamweight division. I think he would just tough. He's crafty and he wants to test himself. So I like that matchup down there. You know, his footwork's good. You know, give him that shot. Darts Jack Reese. Steven. Did what he wanted to do. You know, nice and clean in the ring. Potentially, not to say that, but Fulton, if you- He's threw a lot of body shots this round so far. I'm not saying, I'm just saying. <laughs> Mentality out of Fulton tonight, though he hasn't needed it. German. Oh yeah, he's been in with so many good fights. It's tough because anytime you see Madas come in, Fulton will catch him with some salt. Yeah, so I, I think as the opposition steps up for a stop, stop, let him go, let him go, Cole. separate, boss. Goodness. And that was on Fox. Big. That is the end of the... Steven, cool boy, Steph Fulton.